I greet you in Jesus' precious name. It is Wednesday morning, the 18th of September, 2024. And this is your friend, Angus Buckin, with a thought for the day. We go straight to the Gospel of Matthew, chapter 15, verse 31. So the multitude marveled when they saw the mute speaking, the main made whole, the lame walking, and the blind seeing. And they glorified the God of Israel. Oh, folks, it is amazing when you see a miracle take place. It really does something to your faith, doesn't it? It lifts it right up. I remember many years ago holding a huge campaign on the north coast of KwaZulu-Natal at a place called Salt Rock. And we were bringing in crowds of people every single night with the buses. The one night, the tent was packed full. There was a presence of the Holy Spirit. There was an expectation of miracles, signs, and wonders. And a man came up onto the platform. He was actually one of the bus drivers. He had a turban on his head. He was of the Sikh faith. And he came up with his father. And his father said, my son is mute. He cannot speak. Well, we anointed him with oil. We prayed the prayer of faith. I took the mic. I put it to his mouth. And I said to him, say, Jesus. And he opened his mouth wide and he said, Jesus. Well, (laughs) the tent went wild. It was an incredible night. Jesus Christ is the miracle worker. He is the same yesterday, today, and forevermore. I want to say to you that there is nothing which is too hard for the Lord. The Lord is the same yesterday. He's the same today, and he's the same forever. Hebrews 13 and verse 8. I really want to say to you today, trust the Lord because he's alive. And because he's alive, we can face tomorrow. Do you remember that old song, because he lives, I can face tomorrow. Let's sing it together. God sent his son. They called him Jesus. Came to love, heal, and forgive. He lived and died to buy my pardon. An empty grave is there to prove my Savior lives, and because he I can face tomorrow because he lives. All fear is gone because I know all the future and life is what the living just because he So go out today and trust the Lord for your miracle. That's all we have to do. We have to believe and then let the Lord work through our lives. Receive your healing today in Jesus' name. God bless you and goodbye.